We might want to stick around for one second. Senator Mr. Kennedy uh, has exerted a point of personal privilege. Yeah, Mr. Mr. Jealous. Uh, thank you, Mr. Chairman. Mr. Jealous. Briefly. Uh, and I will be brief. Transparency is one thing. But that's not what you talked about in your opening statement. Now, I, what, what I heard you say, Mr. Jealous, was that, that Chief Justice Roberts would not have voted the way he did in many of the cases you criticized, but for this dark money and corporate money. Now, that's what you said. Sir, what I, what I talked about. This serious is, a heart, is four heart attacks and a stroke. Well, sir, that has please, nothing to I don't... do with transparency. Sir, I don't want to ha have a heart attack. I don't want you to have one. So just let me finish, please. And what I'd say, sir, is this, that the rig system is pretty obvious. When you see $17 million spent to push a uh, nominee through, a pro-corporate nominee through. And the rig system is even more obvious when you look at the hundreds of millions of dollars that are spent to push nominees but through. Say and then it becomes even more clear, sir, when you dig in and you see how many of the same donors... How is it are rigged? How supporting is the Federalist Society, are supporting the campaigns of senators who will then preside over the nominations process. And the people of this country, sir, all we want is transparency, and that's bipartisan. Yeah, yeah, but that's not what you allege, Mr. Jealous. You, you allege biggest doubts. You, you said that that you, you, you said that Chief Justice Roberts would not have voted as he did in some of the cases but for this corporate dark money. Now, that's a well, serious sir, allegation. I would refer you back to my, to, you know, to my testimony. It's all written for the specifics. What I described was a rigged system in which Chief Justice Roberts operates, in which the Supreme Court has become captured by corporate interests, in which the, the, the U.S. Chamber of Commerce, which respectfully does not represent Main well, Street or small, let me bribery, turn to, uh, only corporations, when 70% of the cases that it submits... Let me the interrupt here just okay, one I'm second. Sorry, the, Mr. Chairman. The, I abuse my privilege and I ask your forgiveness. Thank you, sir. And uh, I think it's um, Senator Tillis 